This Ridley-O is sponsored by Breakfast Club dot space slash discord. Duh. So I'm uh, standing here with Astrid and an enemy. Anemone. Anemone? Anemone. Of the Anemone clan, probably. <laughs> this is probably the, the one that's in charge, right? No, I'm in charge. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> anyway, they're, you're not alone. But uh, there are uh, many, uh, more than one of you uh, have... Um, have appeared, uh, and I don't really know anything else, um, okay. and, except that uh, you're on your way somewhere. But uh, you're a, you're a free stater, and I'm I'm curious to know if, if you, have you been in New Hampshire for the last three months, or have you been around uh, the the uh, the area, um, like New England and North Carolina? No, no, no we, North like... Carolina. I have a house there. So, I see. Um, I was here for last year. I'm gonna put him back. Okay. Okay. Oh, boy. Uh, so, so anyway, you and your family have been, uh, you, well, you, you have not been outside New Hampshire in the last three months? Or you have? I think we've been here a little over two months, so it hasn't been exactly so, three, three so you, months. So you got a chance to experience the early parts of the lockdown elsewhere? Yeah. In That's what I'm curious about. Uh, so oh. I'm, I'm curious to know how bad it's been in New Hampshire compared to where you've been. Well, I got out of uh, North Carolina the day or the night before um, they did the serious like, cower in place edict so I had friends talk to me and one friend you know when I was going out of town he's like oh it's supposed to be cower in place not cower all over the place you know so I'm not sure how it's been my sister uh, she has a, a counseling practice and I know she's been doing work from home which has been weird for work and then good for her family my parents live in florida there so i'm really not i don't really know i'm not the best person to ask about that what i can ask you though is how it's been in new hampshire for you what is the craziest thing that you've seen or has happened to you since you've been in your you know over, over the last few months of the, new, of the new hampshire stay at home uh having to wait in line to go into the grocery store yeah i think it's obnoxious i'm doing a series of breadline videos Breadline? Yeah. Well, like, like there's only Russia one. In the 80s, yeah. breadline? There's only one in it so far. I have managed to film a Starbucks breadline. Oh, okay. Uh, where tempers were lost. <laughs> but yeah. uh, there's oh, also, I've Starbucks. seen a Market Basket breadline. Uh, the Market Basket. Yeah. In the Home Depot and Lowe's line. Oh, wait, no, that was that was in North Carolina. There was, they wouldn't let you go in unless you went through this. Actually, they were checking IDs yeah. in North Carolina before I left to go to, to get into Lowe's. Even just. They, checking IDs to get into Lowe's? They were checking IDs to get into Lowe's. In New Hampshire? Uh, no, North Carolina. I'm oh, sorry, oh, I totally okay. forgot that. Sorry. <laughs> now, um, uh, how would you say, I mean, as a free stater, uh, how would you say, how would you rate how things, I mean, I know you haven't been to a lot of other places, but how would you, how, yeah, what's your, what's your, I don't know, Do vibe? You on the crazy stuff that's going on? Yeah, I mean, how bad or good have we done in New Hampshire? Uh, we? Who is we? Yeah, that's a great. Well, how good have we, how good have we free staters done at creating an environment where the government doesn't feel comfortable automatically locking people down? Personally, uh, I know in Keene, we've been to a couple events where there were more than ten people, and um, uh, I think the people, the free staters, are doing a good job, not just bending and cowering in place. Um, there are people in the free state movement, of course, that do believe the coronavirus is a threat, so some people are still staying home, but many are not. And I'm pleased to say that this bullshit epidemic has not had much of an effect on me in my life. Yeah. I'm grateful to say that. What do you think... Um Oh, I've lost my train of thought on that one, but I sort of I asked a completely different question. <laughs> what, what do you think people should do uh, in, in New Hampshire? What do you think... Liberty activists should do to uh, make the most of the situation. You know, I mean, take advantage of the crisis, uh, just like the government is doing, so that we, we can, so that we can play it to our advantage. I think we should uh, go camping, go to Forkfest and Porkfest. I think we should start <laughs> it early and do it more than once a year. Yeah. Um, personally, and I don't know if this is answering your question exactly what you meant, but that's events like that to me personally help bring other people into the fold it helps yeah. teach them that uh new hampshire isn't the worst place in the world even though it gets cold but it still has really good benefits and that the people in the community are worth the awful weather are worth the traveling far away because i have friends in north carolina that 
are very interested in this, but they are like, oh, that's so far away, it's like cold there, oh my god. So really limp-wristed reasons for not going somewhere. But if they came up to visit and did something here and saw the community and how amazing it is and supportive it is, then they would be, there would be a lot more people interested in becoming free staters. Uh, can you think of anything that you have to add that you have been that's been on your mind that you wish you could spew to the public? About what? Oh, about everything that's been going on for the last few months, including the unrest. <sighs> Grow some balls, be yourself, and don't be an asshole. Is that good? That's it. <laughs> All right, thanks. You're welcome. Was that good? Yeah, that was good. Okay. Happy biking and happy RVing. <laughs> Too. It's great. Yeah. This Ridleyo is sponsored by Breakfast Club. Dot space slash Discord. Duh. A non political Discord community with its own Minecraft server and weekly tournaments. Constantly active as of this writing, with lots of members and only 33 trolls. 33 of whom appear to be in detention currently. Whoop. Make that 34. Oh, and they have weekly tournaments. Their Discord is easy to use, and the Minecraft server is Java version. Survival mode. Breakfast Club. Dot space. Slash. Discord. Duh.